He goes, are you from Ireland? And I said, yeah. And he goes, uh, oh, we sang Arthur McBride in Ireland. We learned that song, you know. And I, can I sing it now? I said, no, you fucking can't. I'm going to sing it. <laughs> and his brother went, nobody talks to him like that. <laughs> No, I wasn't playing. I was drinking. I hadn't a clue who they were. My brother-in-law knew who they were, right? I wasn't, you know. Look over there. It's the Black Rose. Yeah. So then what happens? He goes, yeah. He, Jim, my brother-in-law says, that's the Black Crows. That's the Robinson Brothers. And Lenny Kravitz's gang were in there as well. His band, right? And they were they were in that band as well. So next thing, the uh, I went over. I got grabbed my guitar. I had a few drinks on me. Grabbed my guitar and I said, hey, do you fancy a session? And he says, no. Uh, and then he, I said, okay. And then he said, oh, you're from Ireland. I said, yeah, I'm from Dublin. Oh, we were in Dublin and we played a song called Arthur. We learned a song called Arthur McBride. And he says, can I sing it? And I said, no, you can't sing it. I'm going to sing it. <laughs> but at the end of it all, I let him sing. He got in, we had a circle going, it was great. And it was a lashing rain outside. It was peeing down. So where, where could you be on a Monday night on the Plaza? So next thing, come on to our show tomorrow, right? Lenny Kravitz, them. He says, great. He says, many tickets do you need? He says, 10, you know? So I said, I'll take what you've got. So he says, look for so-and-so at the hotel, right? So we barreled down the next day, looking, called the hotel from Odell's, said, uh, so-and-so there, it was their, their manager, road manager. Over no, no tickets here for you, you know. I'm there going, ah, shagger, I should have known better, right? So for some reason, one of their guys walked in again. He said, last night, and he said, I said, there's no tickets for it. He said, just show up. They'll be at the gate. They'll be at the gate of Sandstone. So we got there, but we had a session and a half. We were drinking baby Guinnesses, which is just liquor and Guinness. Just wrong. It was just wrong. Thanks be to God, those days are over. <laughs> and, uh, so me sick as a pig the next day, the two Robinson brothers are on stage, right? So I get out with the tickets, the seats were great. Lenny Kravitz has gone into the crowd, right? Doing his thing. I get out in front of the two boys, right in front of the stage. And your man is in this, and then he just stops dead. And I went, later. And he goes, no. <laughs> just this look, of, no. Pats his brother goes, there's your man again, like, you know. That's the story. <laughs> and tell me about Porter. Porter, Chris Porter, God rest him. God rest him, God bless him. <laughs> God He's rest him too. <laughs> but uh, he was working at Odell's and was off that weekend. And then when he, you know, he's the biggest Black Crow supporter going. Big buddies with them. And next thing I told him, and he said, I heard, you didn't even know who they were. <laughs> and I said, well, I'm aware of them, you know? That's all. We're all Chris. But look at he's doing now. My God, fair play to your memory. Yeah, it's a good night. Yeah, good crack. Yeah. <laughs> you reminded me of it. But the towers hide the horizon to army country life. So I'll find peace on a fire stool at the bottom of the glass. Loneliness must pass. And I wish I was back in old Ireland. Why did I have to go? Leaving my friends and my family.